Hello guys, welcome to my channel How to Learn. Today I want to discuss about hacker rank problem picking numbers. Let's see the problem. Given an array of integers, find longest sub array where absolute difference between any two elements is less than or equal to 1. Okay. They have given an example array a equal to 1, 1, 2, 2, 4, 4, 5, 5, 5. And there are two sub arrays meeting the criteria. One array containing elements 1, 1, 2, 2, and another array containing elements 4, 4, 5, 5, 5. And the maximum length of sub array is 5 elements. So we have to return this array. Okay. Guys, if you observe here, here is the functional description. Okay. And they are expecting return type is int. Means they are they don't want any array, but they want only count of array. Okay. And now I will explain you an example. Yep, if you observe the input is 6. And the array elements are 1, 2, 2, 3, 1, 2. Here the biggest sub array is 1, 2, 2, 1, 2. Because if you observe 1 minus 2 equal to minus 1. Okay. And 1, 2 minus 2 equal to 0 and 2 minus 1 equal to 1 1 minus 2 equal to 1 if you observe like I want to say like subtract in element with another element in this array okay we will get value less than 1 means it can be minus 1 minus 2 0 or something we don't want that we, uh, we want only that we are getting value minus 1 less than minus 1 or not okay Suppose I have added the 3 in the array, then if I subtracted 1 with 3, I will don't get the value less than 1. So I am selecting this array, this sub array, okay. I will explain you another example clearly, then you can understand better. Suppose this is an array, okay. Let's subtract the elements now. 4 minus 6 equal to 2 okay and 6 minus 5 sorry 4 minus 5 equal to 1 and 4 minus 3 equal to 1 again 4 minus 3 equal to 1 again 4 minus 1 equal to 3 Guys, if you observe carefully, our set is 3, 4 and 3. Okay guys, because if you, if you, if you observe difference between 3 minus 3 equal to 0 and 3 minus 4 equal to minus 1 and 4 minus 3 equal to 1. Okay, what is our exit condition here? The difference between elements in the any two elements in the sub array must be less than or equal to 1. Okay, here my condition is satisfying. So I will took my sub array as 3, 3, 4. You, you can ask me here when you counted, you get you got this 3 as uh, 3 elements which are equal to my uh, 1, but why you are not taking 3, 4, 5. Okay, 3, 3, 4, 5. Wait, I'll show you why I'm not taking this one. 3, 3, 4. Let's take this. If you observe 3 minus 3 equal to 0, okay, there is no problem here. 3 minus 4, 4 equal to minus 1, there is no problem here. But 3 minus 5 equal to minus 2. Our condition is violating. I mean, like our rule is violating. What is our rule? We'll get, we want to get our value should be, I mean, like a difference between any two elements in the sub array must be less than or equal to 1 but here I am getting minus 2 so I can't take this 3 3 4 5 so I will take 3 4 3 3 4 as my sub array and I will take it count okay
now i will implement my program first okay guys if you have any doubt regarding this concept or my program explanation or uh, my problem explanation please comment it in comment section and let's declare two variables here in count equal to zero and int max equal to zero okay guys and let's sort this array how we can sort this array using collections dot sort method using predefined method is the best one because you can uh, save more, more time without writing that logics now i want to write logic for this program int i equal to zero i less than a dot size i plus plus and for in j equal to zero sorry j equal to i plus one j less than or equal to sorry j less than a dot size and j plus plus if match dot absolute of a dot get of i minus a dot get of j less than or equal to 1 count plus plus ok and guys let's say let's write a condition here if count is greater than max then replace with max max with count value okay now show is count okay and initialize count with zero and let's return our value i'm returning my max value here let's run our code let's see what happens guys and guys now my sample descriptions are passed let's submit our code let's see what happens guys if you want any more videos on hacker rank or uh, spring boot hibernate please comment in the comment section i will do for you yep it's like uh, yep guys our all test case are passed and thank you for watching my video please like and subscribe my channel